Whether it's a scary forest or an old, creepy building, scary places have a certain appeal that makes them fun to visit. Some people like going to haunted places because it feels like an adventure and gives them a rush of adrenaline. Others find it scary but tempting. Some of the most haunted places in the world are also some of the most beautiful, but you may have to get scared to see their spooky beauty. Welcome back to our channel, Travel Tales. In today's video, we will share with you some of the scariest places on Earth and get inspiration for your next spooky getaway. So without any more delay, let's dive in. Pluckley, Kent Many people in Britain think that the village of Pluckley is scary and full of ghosts. It is close to Ashford, which is in Kent. People say that a lot of ghosts keep moving around the area at night. Some people from colonies close by have said that they have heard loud cries at different times of the night. Also, the government has made it hard for tourists to visit this area. But ghost hunters can still go there to find out the truth. Riddle House in Florida The Riddle House is in Florida. It is in Palm Beach County. Carl Riddle built this house in 1920. He owned it at the time. Carl and his worker Joseph both killed themselves in this house, and it is said that their souls wander around inside the building. No one knew the truth about how they died, but it was said that they died horribly, that their bodies were hung with fans, and that their neck bones were broken. Not only is the house scary, but the furniture, the garden, and even the nearby houses are too scary for people to stay in. Bell Witch Cave The Bell Witch Cave is a dark place where John Bell and his family were killed. The ghosts of this cave keep tormenting the kids in the nearby colonies. People would rather buy or rent homes that are miles away from this dark and scary cave. Visitors to the cave say that even a small piece of rock is cursed, so no one should bring anything out of the cave, not even a grain of sand, or they could die in a few days. Several times, technology has been used to try to take pictures of the inside of the cave, but so far, no good pictures have been taken. Mountsville, West Virginia Mountsville is in the western part of the U.S. state of Virginia. It has been around for 120 years. At that time, it was where the most dangerous criminals were caught. Those criminals were put behind bars with nothing to do and nothing to eat. The goal was to teach them that they should change the way that they do things. Some of these people died because the inside of Mountsville was so scary. People now think that the criminal souls wander around inside this prison and cry every night. This prison closed in 1995. Stull Cemetery A small town in Kansas called Stull Cemetery. In the early 1900s, 20 people lived in this town. A father and his son, both of whom were in the group, died in an accident and were buried in the farm field. The father and son's deaths remained a mystery, and over the years, other people were killed and hung from the tree. No one knows who killed these innocent people, but Stull Cemetery has been called a strange and scary place in many books of the U.S. The Myrtle's Plantation The Myrtle's Plantation has a ghostly residence. Some people make up stories about it, but the truth is that it was built on a graveyard, and people say that since then, it has become a dangerous spot. The ghosts kill kids and women and then disappear. The visitors say that they have seen a woman with long hair wandering around the streets at night. The body of this woman is sometimes seen hanging from high trees, and other times she seems to be alive and well. The truth has not been known for a long time, and this place has not been open to tourists for a few years now because people who live nearby keep complaining about it. Helltown, Ohio Helltown is in the northern part of Ohio's summit country. It was built in the 1970s and was a popular place to buy out. The houses of that time were torn down, and it became a park with rides. Helltown's dark, wooded landscape is scary because the souls of people whose houses were destroyed wander around the town. Ghost storytellers say that Helltown is not a good place for tourists to visit. Only ghost hunters should go there to find out what's going on. During their time in Helltown, some of the ghost hunters died. Even the most experienced and professional ghost hunters are afraid to go there because of this. The Island of the Dolls, Mexico the forests on the island of Dolls, which is in the Xochimilco district of Mexico, have the heads of Dolls. It has become normal for the Dolls' heads to grow out of the shrubs and tree roots. 
People say that a little girl died on this island and her body was found in a nearby canal and it's her soul that gives the trees their dull head shapes. So even if you cut down one of these trees, the new trees will have the same dull head shapes. Shades of Death Road The road is in the US state of New Jersey and goes through about 7 miles of rural land. Several mysteries surround this road. Some people who have traveled on this road say that they have seen white and black souls wandering on and near the road. Several theories say that the murder highwayman used to kill people that were on the road, especially at night when it was dark. It is one of the scariest roads in the world. Gettysburg Battlefield People think of the Gettysburg Battlefield as a place where a civil war battle took place. It was also the scariest place on the planet. A lot of warriors died here. A rough estimate says that more than 50,000 soldiers died on this battlefield during different wars. Devil's Den is close to the battlefield where those soldiers were killed and buried. People say that their souls still come to this battlefield and cry over what happened back then. This area is off limits to tourists because it has a scary past and it's not safe for them. The Castle of Good Hope in Cape Town, South Africa the Castle of Good Hope was built by Dutch colonists in the 1600s. It is the oldest building in South Africa and was once the center of government. Over the years, horrible punishments and executions took place at the fortress, which led to many reports of ghosts. The most famous is the Lady in Grey, a ghostly woman who has been seen running through the castle and crying hysterically. She hasn't been seen since a woman's body was found during excavations, which is strange. The most haunted castle in South Africa is now home to three great museums and a restaurant, so it is definitely worth a visit. The Tower of London, London, United Kingdom The castle, fortress, and World Heritage Site was built in 1097, so it has seen more than 900 years of history. The Tower of London is one of the most haunted places in the UK. It has been home to both kings and prisoners who were tortured, with such a long history. It's not surprising that the Tower of London has some sad stories. There have been many ghost sightings over the years, but Anne Bowling, the wife of the evil king Henry VIII, is the most well-known. In 1536, the king had her head cut off, and her body without a head has been seen walking around the tower. Watch out for the tower's guardians, six scary ravens. The tower is not just a place for the dead to live. Hanging Coffins, Sageta, Philippines an old way of burying people that the Igor tribe of Mountain Province in the northern Philippines still does. Coffins are either nailed or tied to the sides of cliffs as part of a tradition meant to bring the dead closer to heaven. Each coffin is only a meter long because the body is buried in the fetal position. This is because the Igorot believes that people should leave the world the same way they came into it. Even worse, used to hunt for heads and bring them home as trophies. The dead were basically buried high up so no one could get to them. Now, if that isn't a place to go see ghosts, we don't know what is. Chateau de Brissac, Loire Valley in France Chateau de Brissac is the highest castle in France. It was built as a fortress in the 11th century. It has seven beautiful floors, 204 rooms, and a private opera house that seats 200 people. The giant of the Loire Valley has been owned by the Cosse Brissac family for 500 years. Over the years, many famous people have come to visit, including King Charles VII. La Dame Verde is one of the stranger guests. When her husband found out that she was having an affair, he killed her. Her ghost is often seen in the chapel's tower room. She has holes for eyes and a nose, and when she's not scaring people, you can hear her screeching all over the castle. Bangor Fort Rajasthan, India The ruins of a city that Raja Bhagwan Singh built as a fort in 1573 AD. The fort was once full of royal palaces, grand temples, basars, and mansions. It is now an archaeological site called the House of Ghosts. A long time ago, a magical priest fell in love with Ratnavati, a beautiful princess who was a ruler's daughter. But she didn't love him back, so he used her perfume to cast a love spell. When Ratnavati found out, she threw the perfume bottle at him. It turned into a boulder and crushed him. But he cursed the princess, her family, and the whole village before he died. People say that Bangor Fort will always be abandoned and full of ghosts, which makes it one of the scariest places to visit in India. That's it for today, guys. 
Be sure to hit the subscribe button to get the latest update about the fresh and interesting content we keep on posting. See you in the next one.